Hello friends! Today we're going to look at how to create APA 7 and Chicago 18 citations in Microsoft Word using the free Mendeley Cite add-in. These steps can also be used to create other citation styles that aren't currently available in Microsoft Word. First, we'll install the Mendeley Cite add-in. Then, we'll select the citation style. Next, we'll add a source citation to our Word document. Finally, we'll look at how to remove the Mendeley Cite add-in from Word. I'll be using Word for Microsoft 365 for PC and Mac. It's important to note that these steps don't apply to the older non-subscription versions of the software, Word for the Web, or Word for Mobile. To install Mendeley Cite, Begin by selecting References in the ribbon. Next, select Change Provider in the Citations and Bibliography group, followed by Mendeley Cite from the drop-down menu. When the Mendeley Cite dialog box appears, select the Add button, and then select Continue in the License Terms and Privacy dialog box. You will then automatically return to Word, where you can select the Get Started button. When the Welcome dialog box appears, enter your email, and then enter your name and a new password into the Register dialog box. Finally, select the Register button. Before we move on, if your version of Word doesn't have the Change Provider button, you can still download the Mendeley Site add-in from the Microsoft App Source website, which I'll link in the description box below. To select your citation style, select Citation Settings in the Mendeley Site pane, and then select the Change Citation Style button. The default should already be set to American Psychological Association 7th edition. However, from here you can also choose Chicago Manual of Style 18th edition, author date, or another style option. For even more options, select Search for another style. After making your choice, select the Update Citation Style button. Your style should now appear at the top of the Citation Settings tab. To add a citation from Mendeley Cite, we first have to add the reference to our Mendeley Web Library. We're going to cover the basic steps for this process today. However, we can cover this topic in more detail in a separate tutorial if requested. To begin, select the References tab in the Mendeley Site pane, and then select the Go to Mendeley Web Library button. When the Mendeley Reference Manager window appears, select the Add References button. This drop-down menu offers many options, but today we're going to import a file. When the Open dialog box appears, locate and select the file and then select the Open button. Once the file is uploaded, you can select it, and then enter any necessary information that did not automatically populate in the Info pane. You can now return to your Word document. As you can see, my reference has already appeared in the Mendeley Site pane. However, you can select the Sync button, if your reference doesn't appear automatically. Next, place your cursor in the text where you want to insert the citation. Ensure you have a blank space before your cursor, and in most cases you'll want your cursor to be inside the period. Now select the reference in the Mendeley Cite pane, and then select the Insert Citation button. The citation should appear in your document with a content control box around it. Click outside the box to deselect the citation. To add more references to your library, return to the Mendeley Reference Manager window. If you've closed that window, 
you can open it again in a web browser by logging into your Mendeley account. To remove the Mendeley site add-in from Word, PC users can select the References tab in the ribbon, followed by Change Provider. This time, select Microsoft Word from the drop-down menu. Now, right-click the Mendeley Site button, which has moved to the right end of the ribbon. Select Remove Add-in from the drop-down menu. And then select Yes in the Remove Add-in alert box. If you're on a Mac, select Insert in the menu bar followed by Add-ins from the drop-down menu and My Add-ins from the submenu. When the Office Add-ins dialog box appears, select the three-dot menu to the right of Mendeley Site, and then select Remove from the drop-down menu, and select Remove in the dialog box asking if you do want to remove the add-in. Lastly, close the Office Add-ins dialog box. All the steps we just performed are listed on my website at erinwritewriting.com, which is linked in the description box below along with my playlists, How to Use Microsoft Word and How to Use Word for Mac. If you found today's tutorial helpful, please leave me a comment with any other Microsoft Word topics you'd like me to cover in the future. Subscribe to my channel so you don't miss upcoming videos, and of course I'd appreciate a big thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching.